Minecrafters, it's Kimmy Say. How are you guys doing today? I am doing great, and I am really excited because I am sitting in the new log cabin. Oh yeah, absolutely. If you missed the stream last night, this was what we built last night. So we've been working here on the on on the Christmas land or the or winter land, whatever you say. And I'll tell you what, on stream last night we had a bunch of fun. What I did is I went ahead and laid out this log cabin and it was looking pretty epic so far. We went ahead and used some spruce wood and we've gone ahead and stripped all the logs and they look really, really festive. I went ahead and made sure at the end that we had the logs sticking out, kind of like a log cabin would have it. I started working on the chimney, or should they say the um what do we call that thing? That's something big. That's oh yeah, the chimney for the fireplace and everything, and that started looking good. We still have a lot to work to work to do on that, and we'll probably get some of that done today. I went ahead and hauled out a lot of the windows as far as where we're going to be put them. We have a simple staircase right now, which takes us up to the loft area. In the loft area, what we'll do is we'll kind of set up a little bedroom area, as if this is kind of like a bed and breakfast. But there's a lot of decisions that still have yet to be made, and I'll tell you what, the place is looking spec. I'm looking really nice. Oh yeah, it's looking really, really good. And then check this out. 8-Bit Kid came onto the stream last night and she made us this really nice, cozy, you know, fire fire on pit right here so you can sit here in, you know out in the winter area and stay warm while everything's going on she just did a great job you know made a nice brick stone roof on it so you don't like you lose all of your stuff or the wood or anything like that so pretty awesome pretty awesome thanks a big kid for coming and doing that last night um, also we had another guy pop on stream DM he wanted to make a snow globe it looks more like a snow pyramid from here you know and we'll have to see what he does it looks like he's using some um, white concrete powder for snow up here which is fine you know um, I guess he could use snow but anyways no worries there I've been laying snow out all over the place so we still have quite a bit to do if you'll notice up there on the roof we still got a we've got we got some snow layers on but you know probably gonna want to go ahead and get a little bit more plus we want to go ahead and see if we can get some icicles going on so I've got some glass um, that we have up here as well plus we want to decorate like right here what would be great is to have like some sort of like on um, fire pit here but I'm afraid to actually start a fire anywhere near the wooden house with fire spread um, on that would be kind of um, you know I don't want to have to like clean up so I mean this place is just looking great so um, let's see here well you know where to start where to start where to start well let's go ahead and jump into it and let's take a look at a uh, chimney so I've got some bricks I got some bricks and everything with me already here and so let's go ahead let's go ahead and just pop up real quick and we are going to come back over here and let's get on the roof because what we have to do is we have to go ahead and go ahead and get our chimney design going. Now the way we have this is I believe right about here is right is where we have the chimney coming up. And we do want this thing to come all the way up here. Yeah, there we go. And um, what we're going to do here is we're going to go ahead and start to thin this out. Okay. Now there we go. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and pull it up like this. Now, I'm wondering if we should go ahead and let's see here. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do it this way. So let's go ahead and take this pris these pris this prismarine out right here. Okay, and let's go ahead and bring the chimney up like this. There we go. And it's going to be kind of, it's, it's, I think it'll look good. Now what we want to do though is um, we're going to go ahead and um, bring it up at least, you know, a level or two. And I kind of like this chimney as opposed to my other one because we're actually going to have a hole that goes all the way down it. And I think that could be pretty epic, especially if we create maybe maybe we could set up a um, an elytra launcher down there so it can launch you up through the chimney. Oh, that'd be pretty sweet. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and bring it up just a little bit more because we definitely don't want the chimney um, affecting it. Now, let's see here. Let's use some of these stairs here and let's see how this will look. And let's go ahead and there we go and let's go ahead and come off like this and 
let's go ahead and what this will do is this will help give us a um, fluted look to the chimney up here. Mm -hmm. So that's looking pretty good there. Let's go ahead and um, we'll just go ahead and jump off and we'll see what that looks looks like from down here. Okay, and that looks pretty good. You know, I think the height's good. It's a little, it's kind of fat, but you know what? It's a Minecraft chimney, and I think that's, I think that's, um, it lines up with what we've got on the inside of the house. So I think that's okay. Yeah. So thank you, Eight Bit Kid, for dropping off those bricks because you know, to get these bricks, you have to go find some clay. Then you gotta go heat. And then you gotta go take the clay and you got to go heat it up and you make bricks and you got to craft everything together <laughs> so there's a lot of work that goes into that so um, here's what we're going to do I'm going to gather some resources because I need a lot of snow I need a lot of snow I need to go ahead and get make sure my glass is all colored the right way I think what we're going to do in here is a kitchen so I want to go ahead and get the things that we'll need so we can make a really nice effective kitchen because I think some cauldrons would look really good um, and some other things so we can make some counters and everything and make this look like look, look really sharp I'm pretty excited about that and then out here um, I think what we'll do is we'll have kind of like a grill here um, and then we got to decide what kind of doors we want over here as well so I need to go ahead and gather some resources and because I want to start decorating the house because I think this place is just going to look fabulous by the time we're done so um, I will be with you guys back in just a few minutes and then we are going to go ahead and work on some of the details of this not to mention I gotta go ahead and get a whole bunch of snow so we can go ahead and get this place looking sharp here okay so that is all of that okay guys so this is Kimmy say I will be back in just a little bit so we can go ahead and get some of those detail items going okay Okay guys, I am back and let me show you what I've been working on. So I've been working on the landscape So I've been like pulling lots of snow in and what we've been doing is ooh, if I could ice that that'd be really great. Okay, so what I've been doing is um, Using lots of snow. Okay, lots of snow here. Yeah, let's cover that up Okay, and covering up the area and try to go ahead and fill it in so when snow comes in I don't know if you've ever lived in a place with a lot of snow it drifts in I'm gonna go ahead and take a quick nap it always happens it starts to get dark when I start recording okay uh, anyway anyways um, if you've been been around a lot of snow snow when it comes in I mean it's it's kind of like a blanket on the land but yet it can drift really easy and create these really um, tall banks that's why they call them snow banks. And so what I did is I went ahead and used the snow to go ahead and help cover up the desert over here. And so when you go over, so when you're looking over here, you're not seeing the desert. And that was a that was a big deal. Um, back behind here, we've gone ahead and laid some snow down here as well. And this is going to help us um, get this back area looking good in case we put a window on the back of the log cabin. Um, and um, probably what I'll do is I'm probably going to come back here with some dirt. And we're probably going to go ahead and fill this. Um, area with some spruce trees and throw some snow in some spruce trees to kind of like just give us a wall back here that goes up here and what that'll do is I'll help give it more of a um, what do you call it a more more of a winter type of look mountainous look because we'll have all of those there and so that is the goal is we want to go ahead and give it a really nice winter type of look now you know the landscaping is always the always one of the tougher things to do in, in Minecraft because there because when you really start getting into it there is a ton to it but once you start working through it like a lot of times when you get snow stuff you'll have these little plants be sticking up out of it which is pretty cool notice now I've I've totally um, used the snow to help bring up the landscape here so with some more layers I think we'll have something really really nice there um, Let's go ahead and just go ahead and work around the trees some, um, especially trees that don't that, are, that aren't super super low. You're going to have that. You're going to have some some snow drift in there. So now it's starting to look pretty good. Um, what I'm probably going to do is we want to keep this ice here. Is we're going to start. That's funny. It looks like that's become a place for our denizens to come back. So we'll leave some snow in there as if it's drifted in. And I guess we'll leave Mr. Spider down there as well. That's kind of funny. And um, it's really starting to take shape, you know. Um, the snow gives us a lot of lot of nice, nice layers that we can work with. There we go, that's what we'll do there, like that. Very good. The only thing you gotta be careful of is you already put snow layers down. You don't want to um, 
let them <laughs> look funny like that. Yeah, there we go. That looks better. That looks better. And now if we go ahead and do some layers, now we can go ahead and add some depth to this. Like, for instance, if we want to... Am I out of snow? Yep, I'm all out of snow. So we can go ahead and put a big bank here as if it's, like, been blown up against the building and everything. And it's really starting to fill in this area. I'll tell you what, it just looks so... starting to look real mal magical. And if I can maybe put some more um, spruce trees around it, I think that'll go ahead and help um, complete the illusion that we have just had a major winter storm here. Okay, guys, so this is Kimmy Say. I am going to go ahead and do a little bit more snow, and then what we're going to do is we're going to hop in here and we're going to start decorating the area. We got to come up with a um, rustic looking lamp that we can do with these um, with lamps, and we, and we still need some work over here on the ice rink as well. Okay, so give me, a, give me a little bit, and I will see you guys here just shortly after I go ahead and accomplish a few more of these tasks. Okay, this is Kimmy Say. See you in a bit. Hey guys, so I'm back and now I am working on some decorations. So let me catch up with what I have been doing. So what I'm doing right now is I'm going to go ahead and make some bookcases because um, I think we have an opportunity. There we go. For some reason I can make a bookcase. Okay, so here's how it's looking. It's looking pretty good outside. So I took a break from um, doing some of the landscaping. I went and got some icicles up underneath the eaves. I don't know if I'll be able to go any higher with the icicles because I because you know I think that it looks great like that. But uh, you know I went and threw some ice over here to see what it would look like closer to the building. And there, there's some like right there, some right there. I'm not totally sold on the ice up there. So I've got to think about that a little bit more. But I went ahead and got my um, white stained glass. I went ahead and filled in the windows. I think those are looking pretty good. I'm going to need to come out here and do some um, window trims with some stairs. But we can do that here in just a little bit. This is, just, I mean, the fireplace just is looking so good from the outside. So now what we got to do is we got to work it on the inside. So um, I think bookcases will help frame out this fireplace just extremely well. Now I'm trying to decide if I want to go all the way up with the bookcases or not. Haven't decided yet. I'm going to have to make a few more. Got a skull there framing it. So now what we got to do is we just got to kind of work on the mantel piece right here. And I need to get some iron bars. Now I should have some of those in my iron in my iron chest. So let's go ahead and find my iron chest. There is my iron box right there. And let's go ahead and pull out, there we go, plenty of bars in there. So let's go ahead and use some of these iron bars to help frame out the front of our fireplace because we got to have, there we go. And that's looking pretty good. In fact, let's have it go all the way around like that. There we go, that looks really sharp. So that's gonna work, that's gonna work really good. So the fireplace is starting to really come together. I wonder, I've got a picture frame, so let's go ahead and grab a picture, and let's see if we can put a picture in front. Let's see here, Add a frame right in front. Oh, well, I'm going to have to make a picture frame. Okay, so let's see here. Let's grab some sticks. I think I saw some sticks in here. Those would be not sticks. Those are sticks. And in my wool, ba wool box right here, there we go. We got some wool, and so let's go ahead and make a few picture frames. Let's see if I can remember how to do this. Not picture frames, but um, these are going to be called um, paintings, right? Yeah. Okay. So... I'll throw the sticks out for a moment. I can always come back and get the sticks. Okay, let's put the iron bars back because I think the iron bars... I wonder. Nah, iron railing, that wouldn't work. We'll do we'll do a post railing. I was thinking I was like, maybe I'll use an iron railing for that, but no, no. And see that's you know, when you're when you're doing the building, you gotta you gotta make decisions like that. Okay. So now I've got my paintings. So let's go and slap the paintings and let's go ahead and see how that would look right there on the fireplace. Oh. Oh. Well. Um Maybe we won't do a painting on the fireplace because we made it three wide. The painting is not going to look well across it. So what we might do is we might do something different that we can pull off. I know right now I need to go ahead and get some rest. Now let's see here. So um, what we want to do is I got some item frames. So we might go ahead and use some of those to go ahead and put some up there. 
so let me see here. Um, I definitely know that we want a painting on the wall in here. So let's go ahead and take the two paintings that we made and let's go ahead and position them. Um, whoa, no, that's not, that's, that's, um, no, I don't think that's going to work. I'm not even sure what that is. Pig face on that. Some of the paintings kind of creepy looking when you said, but, um, definitely, um, let's see here. Let's go ahead and let's, um, do something like that. That way we can control the painting a little bit because we don't want it to, um, yeah, I think we'll be able to get something like out of that. Let's see. Yeah. I mean, not my favorite painting. Let's see here. No. Yeah, I think that's going to be the best we're going to get off of that. So let's go ahead and let's get that going like there. Yeah. I mean, one of the things that'd be really great with Minecraft and their paintings is if, um, you know, I bet you there is a data pack to add more paintings and more variety. I'm going to look into that. I mean, I like playing Manila, but I mean, I just don't like the Minecraft paintings. Um, okay, so this is going to be a kitchen, and this is going to be our living space. So I guess what I want to do is I'm going to go ahead and get a door here, and we're going to fill this up. So that's like the under the stairs door, and I think that'll work good. Um, I think we want to go ahead and build up a railing like right here, but I think we want to go ahead and get a get a couch like sitting right here in front and like right here we want to get a little christmas tree going on right there so we're going to have to figure out how to do that because the blocks <laughs> the blocks are, are just so big and i'm not sure how we're going to pull that off in that small space and we we may or may not pull it off so that's that's the trick the nice thing is we got the big christmas tree out here so if we don't quite get it in there i you know i think we can i think we can t take that challenge up and say okay yeah you know we we did okay we did okay we didn't quite hit all of what we were going to do okay now what would happen to my ice box i bet you it's sitting over in here um yeah that's my ice box right there so let's go ahead and um put the ice box down and let's go ahead and dump all this snow of course it doesn't have any ice left and it has well it has a little bit of ice um but not that much and let's go ahead and put my wool back in the wool box there we go okay so um Okay, first things first, let's go ahead and get some um, chandelier material. We'll go ahead and use spruce. I think that'll be a good color for in here. And let's go ahead and take this and let's go ahead and put it right there. There we go. And then let's take... Do I not have any of those with me? I guess not. Let me go ahead and grab some lanterns. I must have shoved them in a box over here. Where to put my lanterns? Um, let's see here. I mean, I know I have prism reading thing going on, but I'm pretty sure I just shoved my lanterns in an empty box here. So. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Well, there they are. Okay, so I've got my lanterns back. Let's go ahead and. Go ahead and create a a lantern. Hey guys, so so working on the interiors. Looks like I got the lamps up. I think they're looking pretty good, and I think they'll look really good in there. Hey, JWM will showed up and over live stream. He said he wanted to build a snowman, and you know what? He's building a snowman, so I'm pretty excited. I'm glad that he had some time in his busy day to come out and build a snowman with us. So that's pretty awesome. Hey. My spider's still down there. Okay, so let's, I think he died. Okay, so what do we got going on here? Okay, so we've got lighting. Okay, we've got this. Now what we want to do is, I think what I want to do is, let's go ahead and use this to kind to kind of build up a um, little area in here. Um, you know, so does that look good? I don't even think that looks good. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and block it up and then put a picture there. I think that's what's going to what's going to look really good here. So, um, yeah, you know, I mean, it is what it is. There's not a sometimes, you know, there's not a good idea. And but if you got a good idea, I would love to hear about it because you know what? It doesn't mean just because I don't have a good idea doesn't mean that there aren't any good ideas, you know. Now, we could put a door right there. 
Um, in fact, a little pantry door would look really good. So if we were to find a, ooh, let's see here. In this case, I need, yeah, we could put like a jungle door or an acacia door, but I don't think that would really fit and match as well. Okay, so that's, let's see here. Um, what I need is some rockets. So let's go ahead and take some rockets and let's go find ourselves some more birch. And I think I have just a wee tad of birch stashed over here still. Okay, not there. Um, definitely need some birch. Where is my birch? Birch, birch, birch. I probably have some stashed somewhere else. Well, I got those. I could probably turn those into... Um, yeah, actually I can. Let's go ahead and just do that. Maybe because I don't need those. Where'd they go? I put them back up in there, didn't I? <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and take these birch. There we go. And now, let's see here. Hotel still needs some work. We gotta go ahead and get some of this going on. Uh, yeah, this, I like the way it looks in there. It's pretty cool. Okay, let's go back out. There we go. Let's head back over to... Oh, he's making a big snowman. Good job, JW. Okay, now let's go ahead and get over here. Let's make sure we eat. There we go. And let's build ourselves some some birch doors. We only need three. I doubt if we'll use more than three. You know? Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. Yep. We're going to use birch for our front door. I think that would look great. I mean, I, I mean not everybody likes birch doors. But the, what I like about them is you got that white glass texture, which I, 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 I honestly, I really do like. I like that white glass texture. And plus, the doors are going to give us some nice contrast. Um, in fact, where is my picture frame? That would not be a picture frame. Let's go ahead and hang a, f a picture right where you walk in. Hmm. Let's not do that picture. Let's see here. Ooh. Let's go ahead and hang one. No. Okay. Let's put that there. Let's try hanging one. There we go. I'm not quite sure what that pixelated mess is, but we'll use it. We'll call it avant-garde. And I think well, that's a really nice thing. When you walk in, you get a picture. Okay. Now, I'm going to go ahead and grab some pressure plates because that's just the thing of me. I like being able to get in and out of my doors pretty quickly. Let's see here. And I think... Um, the spruce pressure plates will look just fine um, in here. So that's kind of like... There we go. Very good. Alrighty. So there we go. We got a nice inset door. You know what would look really, really good there is if those were pillared. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. Cause I don't... Let's do that. On both sides. Okay, there we go. Nice. And see now we've got that nice texture there. And I think that that helps frame out the door some. Yeah, there we go. Uh, might do it for the windows too, because I don't know if I'm a big fan of the way the windows are looking. Okay, so now we've got this nice area here. Let's go ahead and pull back our posts, our fence posts here. And I think what we want to do is we want to go ahead and go ahead and have those posts like right about there so you can go up and you come down here you know what's going on yeah I think that'll work good um, let's go ahead and have the steps start up like that yeah I think that'll work in fact then we could probably then go ahead and just do that and then boom and up there like that. Okay, I think that's going to work. Um, let's go ahead and put some posts up here for safety. We don't want people falling down. There we go. And then now we've got a real loft suite type of area going on. I think that's looking pretty good. Okay, now um, video is starting to get a little long. So let me go ahead and get some carpet. We've got a few different types of carpet here already. 
Got some red carpet, which is always one of my favorites. And since we're doing a Christmas build, I am all good with using some red carpet. Um, but I, I like a dark green. I wonder if I can get a dark green. I don't think I have any dark green. I've got plenty of cactus green. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I'm going to have to go cook some. Yeah. I'm going to have to go cook some dark green. Check it out. The snowman is getting built. Let's say, let's let him know. There you go, JW. Good start. Okay, now let's see here. What I want to do is I want to go ahead and get a couple of porch lights up here. Okay, but we need to go ahead and frame those out. Because... Funny. Because we don't like... Well... Mm-hmm. <laughs> gonna have to move that but that's okay I think I can do that and then there we go and now ooh, can I still get it I think I can okay problem is I'm running out of yeah let's see here let's give him a really good shovel because shovels aren't usually the things that I have problems with. Ooh. Ooh. I got plenty of shovels. We'll give him this one. Here is a nice shove shovel. It should be. Looks like he went to go do some repairing. But I just gave him a nice mending shovel, so I don't think he's going to complain about that. I think he just hit something and died. <laughs> oh, poor guy. <laughs> what did you hit? He should really wear armor. I have no idea where he, where he hit it. Oh, there it is. Well, you got to be careful when you're flying the friendly skies, right? Okay. Gotta be careful. Alrighty, let's get a nap in. Okay, guys. So, um, it looks like, you know, we are kind of getting to the point where I'm just about out of time. But let's lay some carpet down and let's see what we can do really quick inside there before I leave you guys for the night. Okay? Oh, I think I have his um, arrows because I don't think I had arrows down here in my hot bar. Okay. So. Yeah, but he didn't have a bow, so I don't know <laughs> what a stack of arrows are going to do for you. I, I, I got plenty of stacks of arrows I can give him. Okay, so we're back in here. Um, let's see here. What we want to do is I want to go ahead and use some carpet to kind of just um, give us a nice... There we go. I think that'll look really good. And if we go ahead and put a couch right here, um, 
let me go ahead and do that and let's let's kind of kind of end end things here unfortunately I'm just running out of time so I, I gotta go ahead and um, decide what what is next okay so we'll go ahead and put a nice three couch there we'll go ahead and put a nice um, chair there maybe even a ooh yeah we can do it that way and let's go ahead and grab the signs because I got some signs and with signs you can go ahead and give it a a look let's see I got better signs now I got better signs on here yeah there we go so let's go ahead and finish out this couch area okay ooh might have to do something about that nice no not nice no oh boy so put that back and then let's go ahead and try our signs yet again okay because what we want to do is we want to there we go we want to go ahead and give these a nice couch like look there we go nice I can oh no I cannot wait for the for the next 1.4 114 update because then we'll be able to do different colors of sign uh, there we go. Different colors of signs. And that's just going to look really, really good with um, being able to make couches and stairs. Plus, instead of using just, just being able to use... Well, wood stairs are pretty common, you know. But we'll be able to use all sorts of other different colors of stairs and everything. Okay, well, this is just a start. What we're going to do is we're going to do a lot more work in here. But, you know, I want to say, hey, guys. Um... Thanks again for watching. I appreciate you checking things out. Looks like I got one more episode to do in this area before we can get it done. So, thanks again for watching the show. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. I hope you guys are having a great day, and I hope you guys will have a great week, whether it's at school or work or wherever you guys are playing. This is Kimmy Say, and say thanks. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe. Keep recommending the channel to others. Help this channel grow. Let's get this thing to the point where we can get to 1,000 subscribers, because that, that's a huge deal if we can do that. And I know with all you guys' help, we can can do this. So this is Kimmy Say saying thanks. Have a great day.